What's going on guys? This is JT here. I'm over here on the iOS server on my free to play account. In this video, I'm going to be getting my first ever hero to break through level 20, which I'm super pumped up about. Not only that, I'm going to be opening up all kinds of rewards in the warehouse, including 15 official event hero cards going for that one hero, Boral Fox, that I am missing. And on top of that, there's a lot of events today and today is Clashers Day. So for Clashers Day today, I mean, the rewards are like, man, okay. Actually, I do need some Zenith Stones. I also need some uh, Igniting Stones as well. And also, Super Pet Snacks are nice, along with the new Karamic Rocks, or some of the, kind of the new Karamic Rocks. But, title to battle to, let me just show you guys something. This was frustrating me. Let's go ahead and claim this. I noticed it said, hey guys, I got a thank you pack over here in the bazaar for you. I'm like, oh nice, thank you pack. What are we going to be snatching up for one gem? That's what I was thinking because sometimes the thank you packs are like, oh, pay one gem, get all kinds of extra stuff, including more gems and whatever. But it's like, no, pay 82 gems for 100 random pets. Okay, decent offer. Not quite really worth it. I wouldn't pay the 82 gems for that, especially on my free to play. Then we got 812 gems. For a temple coupon? Are you serious? That's not a thank you pack. Then we got 8,120 gems for 300 battle talent bat. Like, doesn't I do, this, this ain't no thank you. This is like a pack. That's what kind of pack this is. Now, let's be honest. Is anybody that even plays Castle Clash going to buy this pack? Like, wouldn't IGG game developers be like, you know what? Since we got, like, you know, a couple hundred thousand people playing this game. And not even one person bought the battle talent badge. Like, whoever made that thank you pack literally doesn't play Castle Clash. They're just like, oh, nice. Yeah, they probably need battle talent badges. Let's just come up with a random gem amount. 8,000 gems for 300 of them. Freaking bum, boys. All right, so let's go ahead and get into the altar. If you guys don't know, I always said that I was saving my all my all my breakthrough crystals, basically, right? So igniting stones, Zena stones, apex, all that stuff. For just the right time. I've, I've always believed in hoarding on free-to-play accounts because as Castle Clash evolves, better things come out and you want to have the resources to be able to, you know what I mean, max out those new heroes if you do get them. And now we got these new super mythic heroes and I was like, you know what, should I save my Apex Crystals? Should I save all my Breakthrough Crystals? And then, you know, basically use them on some of these new heroes. I was like, eh, no, nah, I don't think I actually want to do that quite yet because I do want to have some fun in a lost battlefield and in order to do that you really need some high breakthrough level heroes right so i went ahead and started breakthrough in some of my heroes now you can see now pretty much my highest breakthrough level hero before today's video was level 20 and now i got a bunch of heroes at level 20 i mean i got my wallet 20 he's always been 20 but now i got rambard 20 the reason why i did that because honestly rambard helps me out a ton in not only lost battlefield but also guild wars and some of these new dungeons um What's the new dungeon instance called? It's called the Mastermind Dungeon. Rambard is key in this because not only does he heal, he also revives, which makes that like a breeze for my free-to-play account. So I was like, all right, I'm going to break through up my Rambard. Also break through to my Bloody Mary for Lost Battlefield. Now, if you guys don't know, the main game mode that I care about on my free-to-play is Lost Battlefield, 100%. And on my main account, too. It's just not, it's just the funnest uh game mode in castle clash in my opinion so that's what i like to focus on right so depending on what you're focusing on heroes can be set up differently so mine are going to be set up for lost battlefield i also got the uh sanctus break the level 21 we got lazulix at 21 we also got my man zealot at 22 we got levanica at 25 dove at 26 and the first ever breakthrough level 30 here it comes boys man this is so many books oh my gosh this is a lot of books so let me get rid of let me get those books out of here. Yes, no, I don't want to use those books. All right, how many of these? Well, 138 books. 138 books, that's quite a bit. All right, let's go ahead and earn the EXP. 195 Apex crystals with 110,000 reds. Oh, baby, 480 might. That is so much might for one breakthrough level. All right, so we now got our first ever level, breakthrough level 30 hero on the free-to-play, which is my man himself, Zahirika. Now, I'm going to go ahead and hoard the rest of my crystals. I probably am soon to come going to use uh, my breakthrough crystals on something else, but I'm like in the midst of just testing things out, seeing what works, getting back into Lost Battlefield. I did it for the first two days, and you know what I mean? I just don't know the best setups as of yet, but I am slowly learning all the best setups back uh, for my free-to-play account. All right, so let's go ahead and get in. What do we have in the mailbox here? Eight products? Okay, we got oh, the Clashers Day stuff. Okay, that was one of them. All right, so as far as what I got to open up in my warehouse, 
I got quite a bit of everything, to be honest with you. We got a lot of castle chests, which I'm going to go ahead and get into right now. We're going to be cheering for uh, blue crystals from these 29. Come on, blue crystals. We got 150, 300, and zero. Wow. Well, look at that. We got eight uh, eight of those augmented ones. That was kind of crazy. All right, so those rewards are not bad. We got a bunch of extra fame as well because I needed I need a lot of fame on uh, my free-to-play. Also, I've been running kind of low on fame. All right, so from this, we want to see red crystal boxes. We got 27. Come on, baby. Red crystals. We need them for breakthrough levels. Come on. 150 and none. Yikes. So 300,000 red crystals. Not really that great from those, to be honest. From these, we want to see books. Books all day long and also... Um, those Keramic Rocks up there. So those are the expensive Keramic Rocks. So we got 40 of them, which actually isn't even that bad. Only 30 bucks total. Not that great. Let's go. What do we got next? We got these bad boys. Oh, baby. All right, let's go ahead and open these first. Then we'll go, come back to those. All right, so we got 200 Igniting Stones and 400 Igniting Stones. Okay, we'll take that. Plus, obviously, some additional scraps. Now, 352 of these. Oh, baby. We got 3,865 books. So 3,800 books right now after opening up 300 of those. Come on, we got 200 books. We need to see a lot of books. 100 books, no books, 500 books. We'll take that, 100, come on, keep it up. Give me some more 500 books. All right, 200 each time. 200's a fair amount. I'm happy with 200. Anything 100 or less, I'm kind of unhappy with. 200's not bad, 200 more. 500 again, we'll take it. 100, 300, none, that feels bad. 400, okay, 100. We got 200, come on, give me 600 one time. We got another 500, another two 500, three 500s in a row. Oh, baby, we will take that. That was the sickest streak I've ever seen, like, ever opening these books. Three 500 books in a row. We got another 400. We got a miss right there. 300 again, ending it with 100 and another 100. Wow. Let me look at this again. That is just sexy. 1,500 books from 30 chests. Okay. And that puts us at, oh, back at 12,000 total books. That is huge. We will take that all day long. Now, as far as the event hero cards, if you guys don't know, the only hero I'm missing is the Boral Fox. So 15 of those. We do have some events. We'll open up those cards at the end. We got Creation Machine, which I'm going to go ahead and snatch up a Young Spark. Who we got? We got Igniting Stone. 1,000 Igniting Stones. All right, can't be mad with that. It's better than the title talent badges or whatever the badges in general. We don't like those. All right, we also got this, which I don't want to forget. Let me go ahead and claim that bag. What do we got for five? We got Perk Trait Changer plus Igniting Stones. Okay, let's see. I need to actually get that Perk Trait Changer for my main account as well. I need to not. So, oh, yeah, we got Catch a Prize, boys. Now, if y'all don't know, Catch a Prize is one of the most important events for free to play. If you get lucky, you want to land on the coins, baby. And you want the coins to be at least 10. 10 coins. Come on, one time. Hook your boy up with the coins. What do we got? Ah, of course we got the present. Feels bad, man. The present sucks. You never want to land on the present and catch a prize. We got five or ten level five talent chests. That's actually awful. We don't need a five level uh, ten talent chest. We also got courtesy card. Let's go ahead and get that. We don't care about the raids. We got floating isle. Let's go ahead and gain the rewards from that. We'll take two more chests. We got hero collector, which... And then I have some decent stuff in Hero Collector today. I mean, both dragons, if you roll a Warlock, might be worth it for some people to roll. However, I don't spend any gems on my main account. Oh, that stink. I mean, not my main account. On my free-to-play account, whatever it is. Not Treasure Mining. Now, we got Carnival Cake going on, which is sad times, because since it's not Treasure Mining, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to get any of these rewards, which I would really like to get that Magic Powder, but it's okay. Whenever it comes around next time, we will then do it. All right, boys, before we end the video, let's go ahead and open up the goods. We got the Hero Official Event Cards, 15 total, and I'm looking for the Boral Fox. Already got the Saintus, Bloody Mary, obviously Rambard, and Hotshot. Come on, baby, give me the Fox. What do we got? We got Hotshot. I'm opening up five yellow and then ten at the same time, I think. All right, we got Rambard for the second one. Come on. What? Another Saintus? That's pretty lucky, man. A backup Saintus on the free-to-play? We'll take that. Come on, Fox me up. We got a Bloody Mary. Can we possibly get all of them within five rolls? Then we got... Nope, another hot shot. All right, so we got 10 left. Oh, baby, all at the same time. 10 of these bad boys. Can't believe we got a backup Sanctus right there. And also a backup Mary. So that's nice to have two backup event hero cards on the free-to-play. Not going to lie, that is pretty good. If you guys don't know, my free-to-play account's pretty stacked also. For the last, like, three or four months, every time I've done treasure mining, I've saved all my event coins. Now we have over 100 event coins on the free-to-play, which is absolutely insane, to be honest with you guys. 300,000 of red crystals. 
Right, let's go. Oh, and we also got seven hero crystals in the free to play. I'm just excited about some of this stuff. Boys had to show it off. And we got a lot of igniting zenith and apex crystals left, which is not bad. We, we got 839 magic powder to use whenever we're ready. All right, so 10 of these at the same time. We need to see the fox. Come on, baby. Fox me up one time. What? Really? What a crazy opening. Another Sanctus. Wow, the Sanctus is like the hardest one to get, too. Five Rambards, two Marys, and two Hot Shots with another Sanctus. So that means I've gotten three Sanctus on my free to play. All right, what are we getting from this? I want to see uh, Miss Magic Soul Stones, I guess. I don't know. I kind of need Miss Magic. Okay, we got 10 Zealot Soul Stones and 30 Zealot Soul Stones. All right, so we got 40 Zealot Soul Stones. Don't really need those. So yeah, I think that pretty much does it for the video, boys. I don't really think there's anything else really care to do. I'm running kind of low on gems. 9,000 gems, so I gotta keep up with my quest that way I can raise up my gems sooner than later. Got more than enough books to break through some heroes. Got breakthrough crystals, too. We got a lot of stuff. We're coming on strong over here on the free-to-play boys. We got it all birdies. Bro! We're we'll gonna go ahead and open up these last two chests right quick. Go ahead and snatch up 100 books. Two in a row, actually. Oh, here's 100 books right here. End it with that. Nope. Anyway, guys, hope y'all enjoyed the video. I am out of here for now. Peace out, fellas.